Well, we've got some treats here for guess who. <laughs> what are you doing, Bootsy? Huh? Glad you're okay. You guarding by the Confederate flag here? Hmm? <laughs> I saw you crawl up here no problem. Looks like you're doing okay. Stars in the bars. Yeah. And we got Boots the Rebel Cat. You doing okay, buddy? Huh? <laughs> he loves that stuff. I guess you've been hanging out in here because I haven't been using this little Suzuki 4x4 thing too much. I've been using the old Camino. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You looking good, guy. This is a proper place for you to be, too. Right in front of that flag. <laughs> Let me get some more here. It's the old Suzuki hardtop, man. One thing at a time. I remember when I got this hardtop just a year and a half ago. Tough to find it. You know what, it freaking seals out the weather pretty damn good. A lot better than the soft top. A little more secure to keep some stuff in there, too. Oh, wow. <laughs> You're my little buddy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and that's him. And it was, uh... And getting ready to fix and use that thing here. I was going to drive this little 4x4 Suzuki thing. But I figured since he's up there, <laughs> I'll let him, let him. This is one of his favorite spots, too, up on the roof of this thing. He likes hanging up here. And, uh, you know, no snow loads over here. But uh, just a quarter inch plywood painted up some and uh, tarp and some roll roofing over the tarp no snow loads just good enough to keep the weather out it's kind of thinking about uh, to do what kind of structure I want to make up there in Tennessee you know I was thinking about doing a, a 16 by 20 then if you do three of those if you got 10 foot walls you can put six foot additions on each side with eight foot walls and um, you'll have a 30 by 60 pretty good size but you know, in other words you can do it in pieces modular but I might go the double wide route or the single wide route and uh, brace it up a lot and add on to it because you can uh, those things are pretty strong because they got a they got a so the way they're made now, they're pretty good. If you got the two by six construction and the steel perimeter frame, um, they're not they're not too weak. Then if you put some kind of, um, uh, you know, the, what was it the five eighths inch uh, lap board planking on the inside in the walls to strengthen everything up, plus um, you do a, a half log siding on it, <laughs> it might be a manufactured double wide. You're talking something that's incredibly strong. Yeah, I'm uh, just thinking about something like that. You look good up there, little buddy. You look good. <laughs> you guy's okay, man. I don't like this cat, man. He's a. He's a. So nothing ever happens to him because every time I think he's okay, you know, I get, you know, it's almost like you don't want to jinx it. But he's been doing good for years now, so he seems to uh, know how to avoid trouble for the most part, which is good. There's Panda Cat. I just gave him some treats, too. So I'm not going to be going anywhere right now because I don't want to scare these guys. So I'm going to start the engine up. We'll go flying. So <laughs> wait a little while. <laughs> you know? So... Anyway, the time I worry about these guys, they show up, both of them.
Yeah, they get along pretty damn good. Where's my Putin at? Is he in here? There you go. Hmm, got that zoomed in too far. Where you at? Huh? Yeah, he left. Anyway. <laughs> you looking okay, little guy. You looking okay. Right? Say hi. Meow, huh? He came over here last night. I heard him go, meow, meow. Freaking 3 o'clock in the morning. Give him some food. <laughs> yeah, it's freaking... This is an all-night cat eatery, for crying out loud. Take care of these guys. 24-hour cat service going on here. That's for sure. Anyway. So, and I've been giving um, Gold Digger, she's been getting the carbon C60 twice a day, two or three times a day, man. She does a, She has no problem eating up the food, and I can, in other words, I give her some of that perfectly chicken with the broth. She just gobbles it right the hell up, so she gets that stuff. These guys, they get some of it. He gets some. They all get some of it, but she's getting a load of it. But she's the one that had that problem with the fur more than anything, so um, we'll see what happens. <laughs> anyway, I'll put this back up on the roof of the El Camino because, I mean, uh, see, Brian, because <laughs> the bugs will get at it. Where do you go? There he is. Yeah. I'll wait a little while before I go take off because these guys will be hanging out here for a while. <laughs> he hangs out on the front steps too. See, this is where, um, you know, this is like, to me, when it's days like this, this is like the real South, you know, the, uh, it's kind of peaceful, no bull sitting around, I'm just trying to play phony, phony blue BS. You just keep your yard neat and uh, keep working on things, right? Uh, maybe I'll get going now anyway, because he's moving away from the car. So, anyway, that's cool. <laughs>